There are two UBC Type C ports. The first is used for the UVC camera, and the second port now we use to record by pen drive. Okay, we can see we have uh, four small windows, so with five multi view. First of all, we can use as a live video switcher to switch directly on program with the, this bar is the program output. In this way, we can switch directly on program. Typical for live production, if we have uh, five cameras, for example, can go directly on program. So this is the first use. In fact, we create some shortcut. We customize some button, this line of 10 buttons just below the monitor, we made some shortcut. So, button number three, we have access to the page of the PTZ number three, of the HTML number three, and we can easily recall the preview that we made. Take. and we recall only the preview independently from the layout of the picture in picture of the program. If we are in the first page, also shortcut number four, we have access to the HDMI number four, so the camera number four. And again, we can recall View. Shortcut number six. Number seven. Shortcut number seven. We have access directly to the page of the white balance, iris, shutter. You see? With the knob, I'm opening and closing the iris. Number six, the RGB. Number eight, the shutter. So with this shortcut, we have a full, quick control of the PTZ for the fine adjustment based on the necessity of the event, on the change of light uh, on the stage, uh, something like this. Just check the network settings. Is uh, 192.168.1.195. Okay, so we open a browser. Yeah, very easy. We have uh, the full control of the device by this app. We check the preview. We can see the program. What's some program? For example, we open a close background. Let's keep this dark background. We open layer number A. Let's put the computer. So I just click in the preview part. I click here and I recite with the mouse. As well, I open the layer B. Let's have a camera. Click and resize and position as you want. And we can save the views number one. can control the PTZ exactly the same way we used to control before, so HDMI number three. See, we change the position. Wow, it's amazing. Change the focus. It's out of focus on the other side. There we go, on focus. Let's zoom out. 
audio mixing, have the, roughly the full control of the mini H from the web page. So we don't need to install any app. It can be as long as in the same network, you can control even from distance. Okay, we've seen enough for today and see you next time.